class, let's look today at exterior angles. So we looked at interior angles in the previous week. So given an n-sided polygon, students will be able to find the sum of exterior angles by exploring a relationship and applying it. So today, the word of the day is 360 degrees. 600, uh, 360 degrees. 360 grados. It is not necessary to write this. No es necesario escribir esto. But please write this. Uh, you don't need to write this either. Just write. Solo necesitan título y FLT. You only need title, FLT, and then do this. The others are more of just instructions and information for you. Okay, I will assume you've done that, and I will move on in three, two, one, zero. I don't remember if I did this last week, but I'm going to try to do the video in English and Spanish. Me olvidé si yo lo hice en la semana pasada, pero quiero hacer el video en inglés y en español. Okay, so let's look at this. Vamos a continuar. Sum of exterior angles of a um, triangle. Suma de ángulos exteriores de un triángulo. Arbitrary just means uh, just some random triangle. Um, this is not specific. No es un triángulo específico. Um, okay, so... Let's look at what we know here. So, we have this. A straight line. Tenemos línea recta. And what do we know? ¿Qué sabemos? This is an angle. Es un ángulo de 180 Grados. This is an angle of 180 degrees. So we can write this. Measure of angle 1 plus measure of angle 2 equals 180 degrees. Okay, what else do we know? ¿Qué más sabemos? We have another one here. Straight line. Línea recta también. So what do we know? Same thing. Together, 180. Juntos, uh, 180. Aquí también, same thing, straight line. So together, 180 degrees. Okay, so let's write that down. Escribilos. Measure of angle 3 plus measure of angle 4 equals 180 degrees. Medido de ángulo 5 más el medido de ángulo 6 uh, son igual a um, 180. Okay, so this is one thing that we know. I'm just going to write one. Okay, so now what else do we know? ¿Qué más sabemos? Well, 2, 5, and 3. 2, 3, y 5 son los ángulos interiores de un triángulo. 2, 3, and 4 are the interior angles of a triangle. So the sum is, la suma es 180, our favorite number. So measure of angle 2 plus measure of angle 3 plus measure of angle 5 equals 180. So this is number 2 that we know. So let's see, if we take all of this together, we can organize this. Let's add all of those. Vamos a sumar todos estos ángulos. Let's do it in a very specific way. Measure of angle 1 plus measure of angle 4 plus measure of angle 6 plus 
measure of angle 2, plus measure of angle 3, plus measure of angle 5, equals, okay, this is 180, 180, 180. 180 plus 180 plus 180. Okay. So we have two groups here. Tenemos dos grupos. So I'm just going to write that over here. Measure of angle 1 plus measure of angle 4 plus measure of angle 6 plus and then just really quick we see 2, 3, 5. Dos, tres, cinco. La suma is equal a 180. The sum is equal to 180. So I'm just going to write that here, make it a lot shorter to write. Es igual a 180 más 180 más 180 son... Uh, I think that's... Is it called 500? 540? 540. Okay, so we have that. Great. So what do we do with this? ¿Qué hacemos con estos? So let's look at this. Angle 1, angle 4, angle 6. Together, they are actually the exterior angles. Esos ángulos son los ángulos exteriores. So the, the sum of them is going to be our goal. We want to find the exterior angles. La meta es buscar uh, el medido de los ángulos exteriores. La suma de los tres ángulos aquí son uh, la suma que, que, um, que, que queremos. Okay, so let's look at that then. 180, what can we do here? We can subtract it. Podemos um, restarlo. And then what we get here is measure of angle 1 plus measure of angle 4 plus measure of angle 6 equals uh, 360. 360. All right. So exterior angles for triangle or sum of suma de los ángulos exteriores de un triángulo son 360. All right, great. If you need to copy this down, copy it and then move on. So let's look at this one. It's going to be very similar. Es muy similar. Vamos a hacer mismo procedimiento. We're going to do the same process. So we have four um, straight lines. Tenemos cuatro líneas rectas because this is um, a four-sided figure. Porque tenemos cuatro lados. So that means we have 180 four times. Tenemos 180 cuatro veces. Let's just write our statements. Measure of angle 1 plus measure of angle 2 equals 180 grados, degrees. Measure of angle 4 plus measure of angle 3 equals 180 degrees. Medio de Angulo 6 más el medido de ángulo 5 son 180. Medido de ángulo 8 más el medido de ángulo 7 son 180 también. So we have this. All right. So now let's um, add some stuff together. So we see 
two, three, five, seven. So let's review interior angles, angulos interiores. La suma es n menos dos por tres por trescientos sesenta. So it is n minus two times three hundred sixty. The interior angles. So how many? What is n? N is four because we have four angles. Tenemos cuatro ángulos y por eso n es igual a uh, cuatro. So the sum of the angles is four minus two. Oh, sorry, that's one eighty. Cuatro menos dos por ciento ochenta. So dos por um, ciento ochenta is equal to trescientos sesenta. Okay, so we have that. Now let's um, add those together. Measure of angle two plus measure of angle three plus measure of angle five plus measure of angle seven equals 360 degrees. Okay, so if we look at this, this is the interior angles. Yes, so we got that. And then now let's look at our exterior angles. Right there. We want to find that. So, measure of angle 1 plus measure of angle 4 plus measure of angle 6 plus measure of angle 8. And then I'm going to have to change some colors here. Plus, and then th this is 360. So I'm just going to put 360. equals, okay, 180. ¿Cuántos um, tenemos? Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Okay. Por cuatro. So you can just multiply that by four. You don't need to add them all um, every single time. So now let's do this. So if we look at this um, we have let's see seven twenty I think so we have this thing plus three sixty equals I'm gonna turn that into seven twenty so we can subtract three sixty And then we can just do that. Measure of angle one plus measure of angle four plus measure of angle six plus measure of angle eight equals 360. So we see the sum of exterior angles for a quadrilateral So basically n equals 4 is also 360. So actually when we do this, this is going to happen no matter what. So the conclusion we can make here is that the sum of exterior angles of any polygon is 360. So go on to our canvas page do the quiz there, you can do it more than one time. So la con conclusión es la suma de ángulos exteriores de cualquier polígono es 360 grados. Y ahora tienen un quiz en una prueba en Canvas, solo necesitan hacer esto, entonces um, you're done. Um, pueden hacerlo más que una vez, si es necesario. All right, have a good day, everybody.